Hey everybody, welcome to View from the Chief Seats. Today we've got boxes on boxes on boxes on boxes to unbox. Smuggler's Bounty, Nerd Block, Loot Crate, all 15 minutes or less. Let's check them out. <laughs> All right, the first box we're going to look at today is this Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty. This is brand new this month. Um, it's the initial box for Smuggler's Bounty. And I'm not really technically sold on any of these subscription boxes anymore. But we're going to see what's inside of it. I figured if it's the first month, it's probably going to be a good month. Let's check it out. So right off the bat, when you open it up, you get two things here. Let's see if we can get them clear on the, the uh, camera. We've got a patch and we've got a pin. And both very, very cool items. I could foresee using both of these. Now we'll open up the box and see what we've got here. So, first thing that jumps out, we've got this lanyard with the new First Order Troopers on it. Upside down. Upside down again. It's the Upside Down Troopers. Second, what we have is the t-shirt for the month. I'm going to open this t-shirt really quick. It's very cool. We got ourselves a Kylo Ren pop figure type t-shirt. It should be noted that the folks that put out this box are the owners of pop uh, figures and they've done the Marvel boxes previously so um, I know there has been some concern because the Marvel box is not necessarily the greatest box to get as far as customer service and folks getting things that are damaged and so forth so I was a little tentative about ordering because of that, but let's see what we've got in here. Besides the pin, the patch, the shirt, we've got two pop figures. So let's check out the first pop figure is this Chrome Captain Phasma. And this is an exclusive to Smuggler's Bounty, the subscription box. So very, very cool. I don't have another pop figure that's metallic like that. So I like that a lot. I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. And the other pop figure is this TIE Fighter Pilot. I'll get it without the light shining on it. All black, TIE Fighter Pilot. And it looks like there's two different types of TIE Fighter Pilots that you could get um, based off of what's on the back of the box. So we've got the one that is all black. I like that, very, very cool. Also, Smuggler's Bounty exclusive. So we got that pop figure. We got the Captain Phasma pop figure. We got this shirt which I like an awful lot and you also have the patch and the pin and that is Smuggler's Bounty. So Smuggler's Bounty, pretty good first box. Oh, and we've got this lanyard also. Um, I like the content that was included in it. So the pop figures, you got a figure, you're pretty much going to be paying probably 20 bucks for the two of those anyway. And you're getting the shirt on top of that. And uh, the pin, which I know folks are pretty fanatical about. And the patch. And I love Star Wars patches. Um, so, I like this. And now let's see what else we've got here. We'll go to Nerd Block. And Nerd Block and Loot Crate we've been doing um, every month for over a year now and both of these I've canceled at this point so this is it for my unboxings for these thankfully because I think every month uh, we go through which one is the best which one isn't the best um, and it changes month to month based off of what's included they're all extremely hit or miss so uh, nerd block will open up shirt first and this is the shirt that fits either Mary or Jesse um, and we've got um, Jack Skellington and the DeLorean. Um, and it looks like Marty McFly is on that vine holding on. So um, I don't really know why they chose this as a mashup, but that's a shirt. Um, we've got this from Christmas Vacation. It is the Moose uh, Mug. I like that. Um, we actually saw these in the store recently at full price. Um, nice little thing to put out with the rest of our Christmas stuff. So I actually do like that item. 
Um, it looks like we've got a vinyl here from uh, Titan's Vinyl Figures, and it's Sherlock, and it's uh, Benedict Cumberbatch. Cumberbatch. Um, that's what it looks like. I do not watch this show, so again, when you think of things being hit and miss, this is a miss for me, unless one day I watch it and all of a sudden I'm like, wow, that was a really great thing to get in the past, but totally not for me now. Um, we've got this piece from Firefly um, in this box. Not really sure what this is, but uh, it's engineered by Firefly. I actually have this as a sticker on my laptop. Um, love Firefly. And ah, this is uh, actually really cool. This is another Christmas themed item. We have um, a ship from Firefly. So I like this a lot. Who knew that I would have a little Serenity on my um, tree this year? And how ironic of a name to have Serenity on your Christmas tree. So um, I like that a lot. This is actually really cool. Um, very cool item to get. Let's be bad guys. Um, let's see what else we got here. We have a Star Wars uh, mini calendar, 16 months from the new film, The Force Awakens. Trying to hold this up so you guys can see this properly. Um, here's what the different months look like. So, not a bad item to get. And last but not least, there is a picture in here of Bill Murray as John Wayne. And I know this has some type of reference uh, to a movie recently. Not quite sure what it is. But again, talk about hit or miss items. Um, I could have probably done without that. So uh, that's it for the box for the month. So we got that calendar, the Bill Murray picture. We have this Serenity Christmas ornament. We have the Sherlock vinyl figure and um, the Christmas Vacation Griswold um, cup, moose head mug, and the really weird uh, mashup shirt of Jack Skellington and uh, the DeLorean for Back to the Future. So that's that. We've got this card here too. Um, and of course, um, right after I cancel December's Nerd Block Classic theme is Star Wars. So more folks jumping on the Star Wars bandwagon. Maybe I'll have to um, go month to month on Nerd Block and pick up the next month just in case. Um, so, uh, yeah. Yikes. Um, so it's funny. It says there's uh, also a Leonard Nimoy tribute item included in next month's box as well. So that's really kind of of interest to me. And then here's all the items that are in Nerd Block. So... Nerd block, yay! Um, hit and miss again. It's making me want to look at that Star Wars block a little bit more. Um, last but not least, Loot Crate. Let's see what's in Loot Crate this month. And Loot Crate's been killing it recently, so uh, they've clearly been the one that's been better than uh, Nerd Block. But we'll see what's in here this month. Um, Again, talk about hit or miss. Uh, this could be a fun item. I'm sure Jesse will probably wear this later for a little bit at least. Um, they're sunglasses. You put them on like regular sunglasses, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. They are um, Shredder. So you kind of look like Shredder. And we'll see what Jesse looks like later with these on. Um, but totally not something I would have bought. Um, we have from uh, Fallout, uh, Vault Boy, Bobblehead. Um, I think I'm probably the one person around here that uh, does not play Fallout routinely, so I do know the characters, but I did not line up to buy the game when it came out. Uh, let's see what this looks like. There you go. It's actually a really cool item for folks that like Fallout. I know somebody that absolutely loves it, so I will probably put this aside for them and hand it off when I see them next uh, at the Star Wars premiere actually. So we'll just package that up, hold it to the side. We have this Mockingjay pin. This actually is uh, like a promotional item, which is kind of funny. Um, so 
Let's see if we get a better look without the light killing it. There you go. Mockingjay uh, Part 2 in uh, cinemas. And it's a pin. So kind of thinking like, you know, they struck a deal with the movie company to give those out for free and get people engaged. Um, there's that. There's a thing in here about giving the gift of geek. So uh, just in case you were buying people subscriptions, they're giving you tags to put to note them on the subscriptions. Uh, we've got magnets from Cute or Deadly, or Cute But Deadly rather, from Blizzard. So they're one sheet of magnets that you would cut out and use them again. Not something I would have probably been interested in myself. And um, we've got this comic, Street Fighter Hyper Loot, Hyper Looting, which is funny. Uh, thinking about rioting and looting. But uh, Street Fighter, yay, a comic that will never get read. And uh, Loot Crate Button with a double decker bus on it. Blackity Blam. And then we've got one last item here Blizzard, cute but deadly, um, vinyl figures, blind box, and uh, you get a whole bunch of different blizzard type creatures here um, I would be interested in that murloc in the middle I played World of Warcraft for an awful long time before I escaped the Warcraft crack so let's see what we get here holy cow we need scissors again yeah, we'll pop this baby open what do we got We got Arthas. I got that guy. That guy. And he had a chance of um, five out of every 36 guys would be um, that guy. And uh, he looks cool. He's not a murloc cool, though. I would rather much to have a murloc. Um, and it's funny because uh, on the back... If you see on the bottom corner there is a loot crate exclusive murloc which you would think probably should have been in the package because he's exclusive to um, loot crate but oh well I like me some murlocs and some world of warcraft and what can you do uh, loot crate this month um, amazingly sucked even worse than nerd block so we've got that vinyl figure got those magnets got this Fallout uh, Volt Boy bobblehead. We've got these ridiculous glasses um, from Shredder and uh, this Mockingjay pin. And that is it. I guess they can't be home runs all the time, which is why uh, we're getting rid of these boxes because there's too many swings and misses. So on the Star Wars box, very happy with. Probably continue at least one more month. But on that note, we're going to sign off for now. Thank you for watching and checking out all of the goodies. Um, thank you for all of your likes. Thank you for your comments. Thank you for your subscriptions. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Have a great night. We'll see you guys. Bye. Do it!